Right then everyone, Chevrolet Suburban. Bit of an unusual one, it's absolutely ginormous, it's hard to even fit in the, the camera. Um, it's quite a nice thing though, to be fair, I've just been having a look around it, it's, it's really nice inside, really comfy. Um, I've actually been in one um, before, and to be fair, on American roads, absolutely spot on. Um, they're just potentially that little bit big, aren't they? But but yeah, really nice thing to be fair. Paint works, good condition. Yeah, all around the wheels, the wheels are spot on as well to be fair. They've got massive tyres on. Absolutely ginormous wheels. Um, yeah, no curving on any of them. Right round. I'm just going on to the driver's side now because it's um, obviously left hand drive. There we are though, look at that. Nice wood trim on everything, that door card's nice isn't it? Seats are good, a little bit of wear on there from sliding in and out but yeah, yeah as a whole not bad. Um, just jump in, it's quite high up but everything lights up it'll just do this annoying dinging but um it does have a I'll just put it into reverse and there we are We've got reverse camera on there which to be fair you do need on this um just take the key out to stop that it's got a it does have a little screen on there it tells you the temperature and everything um i'll just put it back in and show you the sunroof i might just shut the door that might stop the dinging no, never mind, but I'll just plug this seatbelt in, see if that stops it. There we go. Right, so it's this one here, isn't it? You can either you can tilt it like that and it kind of opens up the back. Or you can slide it right back. Which is cool, isn't it? It's nice to be fair. It's always nice when it all works. Make sure that's all shut up. Yeah, really nice. Got some cup holders in there. I was gonna say I did just have that open. No, you just have to slide it like that. Bit of storage in there. Are your climate controls on there? Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? I'll just take you into the back. Where there's a, here's a seven seater, is this? There's another two seats in there, and I mean, to be fair, these all, obviously, they lay down so you can get into the back, but they lay down as well, so you'd have quite a big boot space if you laid all the seats down. Just jump in here. And there is a, a little Panasonic screen that comes down from the ceiling, as well as the climate vents in there. Which, um, I would presume go along just move this with this there's a little sort of playstation in there um and again grand theft auto vice city yeah, there's a ps2 in there so i would assume that is linked to that screen in some way um which is quite a neat little trick isn't it um well there's a couple others for that are there uh it's even got some climate controls in the back heated seats yeah lovely isn't it Nice to be a passenger in. I'll just open the back. Just show you this working as well. It's got an automatic tailgate on it. Yeah. Boots big enough as it is, I suppose, isn't it? But them two seats, I suppose if you weren't using them, you could drop them straight down. Plenty of room for cutting stuff about. Just press the button on there. She's going back down. Yeah, I mean, it takes half an hour to even walk around it, doesn't it? But I'll just pop the bonnet up and we'll have a look under there. Oh, I wish it had stopped beeping. There we go. There we go. Could do with a little bit of a tidy up under there, couldn't it, really? But nothing a couple hours valeting wouldn't sort out. Um, Battery over there. Yeah, 
Well, I suppose it has to be a big engine to, because I suppose it probably weighs a bit, I would have thought. Yeah, I'll just start it up. Wow, that drops down, it's quite stiff. Yeah, I'll drop that in a minute. There we are, look, start straight up. Ticks over wonderfully. So if you are interested, please do come down and take a closer look. Any paperwork will be upstairs in the office. Thank you.